I have a bunch of different products to try so you come along for the ride. So the first one I'm going to do is an under eye corrector by, um, who are we? Revolution. Obviously it's light to medium because I am pale but I'm sure there are other ones. doesn't have a scent which is nice. I'm just going to use a finger because I usually find a finger's a lot easier under the eye for me. You know what? That that does work, I think. Um, obviously, I have some shadows there. Um, it has neutralised a lot of the darkness, though, which is nice. This is kind of the worst eye for darkness anyway, so if it's covering that, that's pretty damn good. I look like I've had an actual good night's sleep. It never happens. I think for, like, even no makeup days, I might just use this anyway. Just to, you know make it look like I'm alive. I don't know how it's going to wear. It does feel quite hydrating, which is good for me, um, but it does have a slight oily consistency. So if you have oily skin, I think it might slide off. Normal to dry skin, I think we might be okay. Whilst we're here, I'm going to chuck a bit of concealer over the top and see how it reacts. This looks amazing. <laughs> Apparently, I needed eye brightener for a long time. Okay, okay, I like that, I like that, okay. Well done, Revolution. That is nice. Next, I'm going to review the Super Dewy Liquid Blush, also by Revolution. Uh, this is in... God, the writing is tiny. Flushing for you, I think. There's a slight smell, but nothing major. Okay, I've got a bit on these fingers. Start where I like to place it. And blend from there. Oh, she's pigmented. Okay, there's still some on that finger. I'm just gonna use a different one to blend. That could do a little extra there. Okay, it's very buildable. I like that. And it's very skin-like too. Or it looks it to me so far. Okay, that is a bit overboard. I put too much on, but I like it. It's quite a, a nice natural flush. I think I'm about as even as I'm gonna get. It's quite sheer. Um, so if you're wanting like a big pop of colour, I might not go for this, but this is nice for like very natural, clean beauty kind of look. I mean, I could have done a better job at blending it, um, but I like it. It's quite nice. So another point for Revolution, apparently. Okay, it's time for me to finally review the Trigwell Powder Puffs. I have been trying to get my hands on these forever. Um, and every time they've been in stock, I've not had the money to get them. Um, so, we are, we will open them when I can get into them. But I've only got the minis at the moment. Um, because, you know, I just wanted to test out. Plus, I think, like, that's enough for my face. I don't need the huge one. I hope. So, they say, load it up. And then put it on the back of the hand. So it's not crazy. And that just airbrushed that side, didn't it? Okay. It does seem to eat a lot of powder though. I can usually get away with not using this much. I just hope I'm doing it right. Okay. Real time for you guys. That is nuts. I'm gonna do a little bit in problem areas and then I'm gonna leave powder because I don't think I need a lot. I'm not entirely sure it's worth the hype yet. We shall see, but I do like it and it makes applying under the eye so much easier. So for that it's a plus. I am not sure it's all that much different to how I usually do things. Okay, I've got like two different elf lippies to try. So I think I'm gonna do the Seriously Satin Elf Lipstick um, first. This is the colour Nectar. It's it's very much the nudie kind of thing that I wear. It's not like a true nude for me, but I mean, it's, it's nice. 
I'm just going to try this underneath and then I'm going to try the uh, hydration cool one over the top. This is very much the look I would wear like 10 years ago. It is satiny, like it's like a almost like a soft matte. I like it, I love this colour, it is very my colour. So that's the satin one in Nectar. This other one is the Hydrating Core Lip Shine. Um, as far as I'm aware, it's quite... It's relatively sheer for like the colour that you've got here. But I don't mind that as long as it's quite hydrating. So I'm going to pop this over the top. It smells like watermelon. I could eat this, oh my god. So obviously I'm gonna have to clean this top bit off a little bit. Um, but it's kind of given a sheen to the satin one that I've tried. It's not really done much, it is. It does feel quite hydrating though, so I think I'm gonna use this as like an everyday. Um, also the smell is divine. I'm just gonna sit and sniff this. It is so nice. Oh, I forgot to tell you what colour this is. This one is, I believe, lovely. Um, I thought I was getting joyful. No, I must have clicked lovely then. I like it either way. These lippies are lovely. Like, I love elf stuff, generally. But for some reason, I haven't tried their lippies. I have no idea why. I like this. I look very cute. I like myself today. Okay, final step is setting. I usually use the matte finish. Um, I got this for free from NYX when I um, got through the first round of the Makeup Addicts Awards. Um, so I got this for free and it's, it's running out and I'm not sure I like the whole matte thing. So instead I've got the dewy finish to try. Here we are. Smells much the same as the other one, so that's nice. Um, I'm gonna give this a quick spritz. I do sort of douse myself in it, to be fair. Let me let it dry for a minute. Okay, now that has dried down a bit, um, it is very, like, it's not overly dewy, it's just me moisturized, basically. Um, it's almost as if I haven't powdered, I guess. Um, it's got like a touch of tackiness, but like what I would expect from just moisturising my face. I definitely think I prefer that to the matte. Um, I don't think I'm a matte girly. It is not great for dry skin anyway, so dewy is the one. So yeah, generally all of the products that I got, I actually really like. If that changes, I will let you know though. Um, either in comments or with an extra video as an extra review um, but for now for now I think we're good if you stuck around this far thank you so much I basically do makeup lifestyle fashion all sorts of types of content when I'm able to due to different illnesses going on so hi I'm Emmy. nice to meet you I hope to see you again soon if you've enjoyed this I love you and goodbye.